write your letters every day. Mailman, mailman, mail today. Reach right in and pull one out. Well, now, isn't this nice? You open up the uh, little uh, the mail bag, and, in, and inside you get a little record. And you sent it to me, little Mike. I did. Now, you were in California, and you found this uh, this record on how to train your dog. Uh, and I thought of Sucky. And all Sucky's oh, little puppies. Yeah, yeah. Still up in the air. F fans are up, up the air conditioning unit here on the Hancock building. See, I figure you can play the record, and maybe the dogs will hear it. And, come and then down. you can train them, you know, right. via the air ducts. And this is no ordinary record you found. This is Educate Your Dog. This is from... Um, I don't know who the guy is, actually. Uh, oh, the, so you don't know? You mean the Isaman uh, method? Uh, no, I don't have a dog. Well, there's a there's a picture of Mr. Isaman, and he's surrounded by German shepherds. He's a handsome lad, isn't he? Which later turned and killed him. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to this. The third rule to remember. Uh -huh. Learn how to use mental instead of physical approaches to both training and punishing your dog. Never hit your dog with a newspaper or threaten him by raising your arm or voice. Right. Why? I know you're going to ask, why not? How why can not? you possibly hurt your dog with a newspaper or a baseball a voice, bat or a raised arm? <laughs> if you're speaking about physical... Hey, what do you mean? I beat, the, I beat the dog all the time. I hit it right in the back with a rake. Damn it. That dog is, that dog is not going to tear this carpet up. Now, I don't like this album. This guy's... Uh, I don't, this there is none. What? But if you are talking about mental harm, yeah. then I would rather see a dog hit with a baseball bat. Well, I agree. Both the dog and society would suffer less. I agree, Dan. How many people would rather suffer a slap in the face huh? than have their integrity, pride, or name huh? dragged in the mud? I'll tell you, you ask my son. You know, reach across the plate, I'll slap him in the face. Damn it, uh, that's the way we are here at this house. Here it is the far-reaching and more damaging repercussions of the unseen mental and physical reflexes which we must worry about uh, rather than the visual harm to the dog. Now that's a bunch of crap. Here are three answers given to me by three different dog owners right. when I quiz them about hitting with a newspaper. Right, that's what I do. With nails. Well, I don't have to hit Skipper with a paper anymore. The moment I raise my arm, he rolls over on his back. He's hurting. He's and in a second seizure. Said, I don't have to do anything <laughs> other than look in the direction of that rolled up paper which oh, I keep yeah. on the counter. Yeah. And she runs under the table. And I wet it and put some in. The third in there replied. And beat the hell out of that I dog. I just call her name now and Damn she it. scurries into her basket. That's she right. knows she did something wrong. Because I'll beat it with a. An answer. My, I must say that each of trial. the three dogs is a prime candidate to bite someone. Yeah. Second, I doubt whether any of the three owners knew why their dogs acted like they did, no. other than out of respect for that rolled up piece of paper. They got respect for me. For the voice or the gesture. They must learn that along with respect, the Here. dogs had learned fear and the hate of the object, the movement. Of the well, that's a good one. Here's another. We could make our own. Well, let me ask you a question. Huh? How do you mentally discipline your dog? Well, it takes, uh, it takes a big fist. You just don't let him watch TV? Yeah. Okay. Take that away. Take that away. Take that blanket away. God you. Look at all this dog hair all over here. Come here! <laughs> Here's a, uh, another one. Another album. Attack! Attack! Attack. Meet a man bad. Meet a man bad. Meet a man bad. Bite the postman. Bite the postman. Good doggy. You want some pizza crust? <laughs> you want some pizza crust? Do you want to lick my spaghetti? My spaghetti old bowl? Here, you're a good dog. Bite to meet a man. He bad. Bite to meet a man. He bad. Would you like some hot dog bun? <laughs> Bite to meet a man. Meet a man, a real bad man. Good dog. Good dog. Sit, Satan. Sit. Sit, Satan. Sit. <laughs> Good dog. Good dog. Would you like it too tart? Good dog. Attack Satan, mailman. Mailman, bring Bill bad. 
Good dog. Now, I kind of like this uh, record better. That was a good one. Mm -hmm. where, where, where can I buy that one? I, I know. I remember my dog, Lou, liked hot dog buns. <laughs> Like spaghetti. She'd like to. She'd like to light up, uh, have a hot dog bun and a little doggy cigarette after she'd hump Steve. <laughs> Steve, dog, come over. Come on, get down. Oh yes, where's Steve with Lou? All right, all right. That answers that. Well, thanks, buddy. Want to come to the uh, Budweiser beach party? Sure, I'd love to. Heo, Satan. Heo, Satan. Good dog. Good dog. Mm -hmm.